Hey YouTube world. So um, I thought I would make a quick video today to address a common problem that all of us uh, are facing right now and that is anxiety. And um, as a lifetime sufferer of anxiety, I have found uh, two really helpful techniques that are very simple that anybody can do at home at any point. You can do it uh, when you're laying in bed and you can't sleep. You can do it when you're driving in your car. You can do it when you're sitting in an elevator on your way up to an important interview. You can do it while you're waiting for a meeting to start. It just takes a short amount of time and I'm going to show you those two techniques today. And they're both around breathing. So the first part is what is called belly breathing. So one of the things that happens when you have anxiety is that your breathing gets really shallow. So your breathing really never goes down deeper in, uh, than your chest. So when you're breathing, you almost begin to hyperventilate. So it's and it doesn't really move beyond your chest. So your whole body is not able to get the oxygen that it needs. So what you want to do is you want to breathe. And when you, you want to be conscious about the breath moving down and you want to actually, if you put your hand on your solar plexus, you want to feel your, it takes a while for you to actually um, feel your stomach move, but you want to breathe to the point of feeling your stomach or your solar plexus actually move up. And if you try this laying down flat, you can actually feel it a little bit easier. Um, and when you breathe, you want to count. So you're going to breathe slowly and you're going to breathe in through your nose if possible. And you're going to breathe in four and you're going to breathe out eight. And what that forces you to do is not only breathe deeper, but it also um, gets your mind off of any intrusive racing thoughts that you might have. And it also um, gets you into making sure that you fill your body full of oxygen, but that you also release it. So it's something like this. So that was four in and eight out. And um, what I like to do, if you if you notice, is when I breathe out is actually try to force the air out through my lips very um, specifically. And sometimes I will think about any negative feelings that I have or any tension and use that exhale to force that energy out. So So simple as that. And along with that, the second technique actually um, involves you holding one of your nostrils. So I learned this from a yoga video that I had done. So you're going to take your thumb and you're going to press it against one of your nostrils and you're going to do the breathing. So like this. Simple as that. So um, it is better if you can do it through your nose, but I'm a little congested, so I'm breathing in and I'm breathing out. So the key things are make sure that you're breathing deeply, making sure that you're breathing long, full breaths, and that you're actually exhaling and exhaling all of the energy out. And try to be mindful when you're breathing in that you're going to breathe in light, positive thoughts, good energy, healing powers, whatever um, your spiritual preferences and breathing out negativity. Um, I like to actually envision that there's a light body around me. And when I breathe in, I breathe in that light body and I take it in through my entire being. And then when I breathe out, I press out all of any negativity. And I like to kind of think of it as just like this green black sludge, like when you're really sick and you blow out mucus, like kind of like that, breathing it out. So um, for those of you that are suffering from anxiety, try this, see if it helps you. Um, the nose thing is very similar to the old technique of breathing into a bag. So it really forces the breath to be very um, mindful. And um, I wish you all the best of luck and I hope this helps. Thanks.